Hello everyone, it's Dee. I hope you guys are doing well. I have a haul video for you guys today. It has been quite a few weeks since I have done a haul video for you and that's mainly because um, I haven't been to that many sales. And the sales that I've been to, I've picked up just a handful of things, you know, not enough to really do a whole haul video. So um, I went to the sale a couple of days ago and I found some cool things. One of the things that I found is this dollhouse and it is bear themed or that's what it says on the chair here. Let's see. It's called a teddy bear story. And when I looked it up, <laughs> sorry, that was my dog doing something. Brownie, you wanna say hi? Brownie. <gasps> hi, Prince. Brownie. <gasps> hi. What are you doing? Okay, we got distracted. Um, so when I looked it up, it said that it was the applause brand um, of toys here. So um, I got this as a set. So the dollhouse and all the furniture. So the first thing I have is um, this cute little piano here. So I haven't, you know, cleaned anything. So that's why you can see all the dust on it. So we have a piano and then this piece, I think goes with this, I think it's a table. Um, I have to glue that back together and um, I haven't done that yet. So, but I don't know, it feels like it's still missing like another piece here. So. I don't know, we'll see. We have an adorable rocking chair here and it has that print or that stamp that says Teddy Bear Story on it. And then back here is a seesaw. It goes like this. Oh, you can see the stamp a little bit better here. What else do we have? We have just a stool here and it kind of, it's adjustable, I guess. So that's interesting. And then we have the family here. So there is mom and dad and we have three kids. So we have this little bear here. We have this baby I guess we have two babies oh no we have three babies although I don't think that this is with the set I don't know maybe it could be so um a big family here so that's all of them and then we have this bed here it has a drawer on the bottom and then this piece that's supposed to be a mattress and then this is part of the furniture that came off. So it goes like this. So that needs to be glued back down. And then we have this piece here. Um, I'm not entirely sure what it is, but it came with it. And then we have a barrel here that says Teddy Bear Story. And then it opens up like this. And then we have a couple of kid things. We have a little um, cradle that rocks back and forth. And then we have a rocking horse. So those are all the furniture pieces. This is the doll house. You can see there's the fireplace, the chimney, and then we have um, this door that opens up here this way it says teddy bear story again this is the back side of it and just the other side here and then that's it so there's not much else in the house besides the chimney. So those are all the doll pieces. Um, once I get them cleaned up and fix some of the pieces, I think I'm going to go ahead and list it on eBay. Um, so that's it for this.
So the next thing I found is this Rushton doll, Santa doll here, and he is in fairly good condition. Um, you can kind of see he needs um, some cleaning and he is missing like a couple patches here and there, but otherwise he's in pretty good condition. I was kind of excited to find him. I don't have one like this, so here he is. And I think the tag is still on him. Let me see if I can show you there. And then it says the same thing on the other side. There we go, the Russian company. So here is Santa. So what I was most excited about the sale was the stack of um, children's books that I picked up. And this is just a tiny fraction of it. They had so many children's books. So I kind of had to look through them and kind of pick out ones that I really wanted. And um, sometimes sales list or sell them for about $5 each. Um, since I got a bunch of them, he at first said that I could have them for $3 each. And then when he saw that I got all of these, I think he gave it to me for $2 each, which I think is a great price for a vintage children's books because they can be highly collectible. Okay, so the first one, the first one that we have here is Mickey Mouse and the Second Wish. And um, I'm a huge Disney fan, so when I saw that this was um, a Mickey book, I had to get it. So I'll just show you some of the fun images in here. So that's the first one. And then this one I know I have, but um, I like to pick up extra copies of books that I think would be good to um, craft with. Also, Dino decided to come say hi. Hello. Do you want to help? Do you want to help? <gasps> what is it? What is it? <laughs> okay, so let's see. The Nightmare Before Christmas, and um, I think I've shown you guys this book before, but this page with all the candy and chocolates and such are great. So we have that. We have um, My Little Counting Book. images in here are also fantastic so so that's that I guess I need to go a little faster since I have a bunch of them maybe I'll do like a read through of some of them so we have this one hello Joe the little red bicycle And these are all like the tiny size ones. So they're about like the size of my hand. How big is a baby? We have Lady. She's holding a parasol here, very cute. Don't think I have this one. This one's fun, the elves and the shoemaker. You can probably hear my dog eating and drinking in the background. If you hear some noises, that is what it is. This one, Happy Animals ABC, had some really good images, has a page for every letter, and um, the illustrations were really nice. Like, look at this bee carrying <laughs> the honey in these buckets. We have a Jeep and some, and an ice cream truck. I'm using this new thing to film with. It's like this neck contraption thing. Um, 
it goes around your neck. I'm gonna see if I can find an image on like Amazon to show you guys. And so I'm still trying to get the hang of it. I know that it's sort of a little wobbly, so maybe I'll just have to hold it. We have this one, the Little Golden Holiday Book, and I really liked this one because um, there were lots of holiday images here. And I don't think I've actually like seen this one before, so it was a lot of fun to look through and kind of see all the different images, all the different holidays is what I meant to say. There's Thanksgiving. Okay, we have Alice in Wonderland. I tried to pick books that didn't have the barcode on there, but um, of course, you know, lots of them did. And, you know, if I didn't have it, I went ahead and picked it up. Peter Pan and Wendy. We like Kindergarten. I know this one's kind of a popular one. The Three Bears. We have Cinderella's Friends. I loved her face, the illustration of her face in this book. She just looked really sweet. Then we have Frosty the Snowman. Oh, these are those, um, those nature guides. I didn't realize this was at the back of it. I have a few of these. I have the stars and the flowers and the birds and the trees. I'm sure if I have the, maybe the fish, possibly the weather, but those are cool. We have Santa's Toy Shop. So we just have a few more. Um, the Seven Dwarfs Find a House. Cookie Monster and the Cookie Tree. And the last one we have here is Disney's The Sword in the Stone. So that is it guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that it wasn't too wobbly and distracting with the dogs coming in and out. Um, if, you, if you see any book here that you think you would like to do, like me to do a flip through, just let me know. I'll be happy to do that. And uh, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.